Alright, yo, fuck the timer. Yo, what's up? What's up? What's up? Um, <laughs> let me turn off this timer. I just want to give myself some time to get some water and stuff, but I got some water already, so... I see some people already here, so what's up, Martin? What's up, Lemon? I'm done bad for content? Yeah, bro. <laughs> Ever since losing that Z Z5, uh, it's been... It's been pretty downhill. <laughs> no, but yesterday was pretty good. We got a lot of subscribers from doing that desert event. I was able to repurpose it for a video. Um, we did, um, <laughs> we did, what do you call it? Oh, we did Boudicca Wheel where we got 12 sculptures. That was pretty bad. Um, but yeah, we're going to be streaming until Richard dies. So I've been training with this Richard probably like the whole day. And this guy just won't fucking die. So I'm going <laughs> to, I'm like... All right, let's let's see. They'll, maybe this will get some people in. Maybe it's a more interesting take on uh, on chaining. But yeah, we're gonna be chaining it up. We're also gonna be doing Boudica as soon as uh, reset hits. And yeah, it should be fun. Hopefully. <clears throat> like, let's check the Richard kills right now. How many honor am I at? I'm not at that much. I missed on. I missed runes again. I'm at 100. Top 20 is already at 117, so I'm pretty, I'm pretty far behind. And once, uh, once what do you call it, alters hit, like it's a GG's. So I'm just not even gonna try for top 20. I'm just gonna, you know, chain for the stonks. <laughs> hey, what's up? What's up? What's up, Mateo? What's up, music lover? Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Top one of my alliance? Oh, for sure. Probably. Oh, no, I'm not even. Pro! Pro's first place right now. Wow, I gotta get in call with that guy. <laughs> Try get 9,900. Everyone share live. Haha. <laughs> Bro, Try top 20. I mean, I'm gonna chain. If I get there, I get there. If I don't, I don't. You know what I mean? I feel like if I go into the, with, in with an ex expectation that I'm gonna get top 20, it's just gonna feel bad when I don't, instead of like a surprise. Ooh, top 20, woohoo. Beat Pro in honor. Yo, Pro. <laughs> pro is a, is an interesting guy. It's pretty funny because um, none of my friends chained before. Like they didn't really chain that much, but then after they saw that I got top 20 just chaining, they're like, all right, let's, <laughs> let's start. It's time to, time to, Stop being lazy and start chaining, so. Do, 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 do. Bro, chains. Oh, yeah, you're right. Give me a sec. Completely forgot about this. <laughs> you buy. Uh, uh, Zeph. What was this a bundle called? Thanks so much for uh, pointing it out, Seek. Um, Moonlight Zephyr to buy Moonlight Light Zephyr. I feel like I'm spelling it wrong. Yeah, I just forgot the Y. Zephyr's done. Behind the scenes, behind the scenes. Eight, eight, nine. Alright, there you go. Clutch, thank you so much. <clears throat> hey, yo, what's up, BP? We are chaining it up. BP, did you know Pro is top in our honor, top honor in our alliance? I'm kind of, uh, kind of mad. What's guy doing? <laughs> I'm joking. I don't. I don't even need the coin, honestly. I, I don't have materials. Oh shit. I don't have materials to to build anything, so it's not really a priority for me. Anyways, let's do some Sunset Canyon. I'm, I'm gonna switch off my my gear on my double C. I mean, on my cab march to my double C so I can chain longer. And we'll see how long that guy could chain to. You think chaining provides you with enough gems rather than being a tryhard gem gathering during KVK? Honestly, I don't know how many gems chaining really gives me because I just pop them right away. I don't really count. Um. It would be a pretty good uh, experiment, though. 
because like I, I've always bought I was always always bought jump supply and I always pop the jump supply right away so <laughs> I I don't know how much is actually like from jump supply how much is from bundles how much is from this how much is from that so but I feel like you could never have enough gems and if you could do both at the same time that'd be like best case right Just say if you need a zero PM, you'll get zero, you'll get zero for content. Yeah, Yo. <laughs> you get zero like for not content. So <laughs> I wonder how. Yo, don't this guy's such a snitch, bro. This guy, boo, Panther's a snitch, boo. Bud, please show alliance power and alliance kill so far in KVK, bud. Yeah, give me a sec. All right, it's done. This guy's sleeping, so I don't feel bad. Oh wait, I didn't even use my 50, my, my 5, my 5, whatever, whatever. Let me just get this chain started. I'm gonna actually start from the top, just in case there's a chain pot potential in the bottom. And then, yeah. Let's just start hitting this. We want this to be a, a quite a bit of a long stream, so I'm gonna just hit it one at a time. Trash sub gets zero. Lots of deads. <laughs> oh shit, this guy started the chain. Okay. This guy literally woke up. He's been AFK this whole time. I might as well get my AP worth though. So I'm gonna let him chain. And then I'm just gonna kill the barb. Alright, let's see. More info. Rankings. Alliance power. So you wanted, what did you want? You wanted Alliance Power. So this is Alliance Power. We got 1664 at 16 bill. And then got 1541 at 14.3. And then 1664 again at 13.9. And we got TR at 13.7, peak at 13.4. And then you got us down here at 12.9. So yeah, <laughs> it's pretty crazy that um, 1664 has two out of the top three top powered alliances. So um, we got kills going on over here. Oh, we actually moved up. We were at like 10th before, so we're now at 7th. We got TR at 69 billion, 690 billion Smash Wolves, and then 1664, and then Peak, and then Q7. I don't know what that alliance is, but yeah, they're, it seems to be rather, um, 1664 and 1254 dominated up here. And then we got, we're up here in, in seventh, but yeah, that's what we got. Your video, how many gems from 24 hour chaining? Lol, bro. I barely even made it 24 hours of fighting, 24 hours of chaining, bro. Oh shit. I don't know if I'd like mentally survive. Let me lower down the music a little bit. It seems a bit loud in my ears. Let me know if the volume is okay, though. Um, it's pretty hard to find a place to chain around here. These guys are pretty active with their barbs. I usually try to go or skirt around the mountains. Maybe, maybe around here. And then we could double chain with my double C. Yo, what's up, Nicholas? Sorry, I it took a while to get down there, but welcome, welcome. <laughs> um, yeah, twelve fifty four's KP is insane. They, I think they have the highest KP in the game, so I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> oh wait, I forgot. I was trying to do my Lost Canyon as well. Let's do that. I hope someone hit me. <clears throat> Come chain in matcha. No, I'm chilling. I'm I'm fine. Thanks for the offer, though. I really appreciate it. We aim for a 300 bill alliance KP or Izir FV members not for not meeting goal. Yo, could I show the, the bot or no? Like the, what do you call it? What, oh, did I just hit an SV member by the way? Oh no, I didn't. Whew. I thought I hit someone from my kingdom for a second. But yeah, I'm gonna, could we show like the stats of our KD? Is that like allowed? <laughs> can you show the scan? BP's Mr. Leadership, so. 
Let's hit this guy. Now what? Now I can't show it? Or now you're not Mr. Leadership? Hey, what's up, War Games? It's not updated? It is updated. They literally just updated it. It was updated for... Let me check Discord. Top 25. It was updated for... Yeah, September 13th, like today. I don't know what this guy's talking about, he's tripping. Don't talk trash about my boy Dez though. Alright, if you wanna hit me, it's whatever, I don't really care about those things. Um, I think I have one leadership one I do, let's do that. All right, we got Gucci gear on my chaining march. Hopefully, it'll survive a bit longer. Let's go get some more food. Let's go get some more gold. No more gold. Let's get some more food. I'm just trying to fill in the gaps of what I'm kind of lacking in currently. Mm, let's do this. Let's see what's got. What's up? I bet Plato has like 1% contribution. Oh, for sure. After fighting for 24 hours, I was just actually twirling my thumbs. <laughs> but I definitely could get more deads though. Yo, what's up, Prospect? Hopefully you guys are doing well in 1250, 1254. Um, it's always nice to see your progress. I guess we could do a little map update. Um, yeah, they're pushing. <laughs> That's the map update. <laughs> they burnt down the forts touching. Um, they got this little murder ball going on over here. I believe they still have, yeah, they still have, they built a fort, holy crap, they built a fort over there, so they're not going away anytime soon, they're burning that fort, I believe they're burning this fort, um, they're burning a lot of things, this is not touching yet though, so I'm guessing that they're waiting to build a flag somewhere, oh shoot, my chains. And then on the other point, let me make sure it chains. Yep, that's good. Is that good? It is not good. Wait. All right, and then in the other pass, they are burn. Are you guys burning? That's crazy that you guys could just fight two kingdoms at the same time. It's, it's kind of wild. Two X Imperium Kingdoms. By the way, I don't think they're Imperium anymore, right? They both dropped. Um, yeah, they both dropped. So you dropped the both of them out of Imperium. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. Of course, there's other kingdoms powering up and stuff, but it's still really impressive. All right, let's check chat. Yo, what's up? What's up, Salman? What's up? What's up, uh, Photos? One v two. Yeah, they're they're winning one v two. Yeah, we're chilling. Um, hopefully everyone's good. Hopefully you guys are, are good for a chill stream. I, I saw no one was streaming, and then I saw that there wasn't really much to stream. I mean, I guess if you're in 1254, you could stream the murder balls and the fort burning and such, but, and like getting cheeseburgered. But yeah, I didn't really see anyone streaming. And then I promised I'd stream today. So I'm like, yeah, let's, let's just start this early because I want to sleep early. And this Richard is still full health after killing how many barbs so far? <laughs> um, I think we could do this. Uh, four piece. <clears throat> Got zeroed for the last time yesterday. The last time? Good luck, sheesh. Buy more bundles than my broke ass. 350 troops of 12 mil. Stop getting zeroed. This guy said for the last time, so that means you're gonna make sure you don't get zero anymore, right? <clears throat> I, I mean, even if it's a three piece, this is uh, if I do it by honor, that's 50 honor for 80 AP. I think that's pretty worth, right? Is it 80? 
It's 70 AP. Okay, yeah, this is still a pretty high ratio. Are you the person that wanted to quit previously? Let me see. Some oh, yeah, 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 I remember, I remember. When we were talking with Mitch, right? I remember these things. I'm too small of a streamer not to remember. <laughs> I wasn't playing since one of your friends told me to send him a message, but he never say it to where, lol. Um, Mitch, um, add me in game. Um, add me in game, and then you could be added to the group chat. 7k gem event this weekend hoping that means zenith comes soon too it should it should um there's upcoming events and i'm guessing with these events it's going to be zenith it's going to be um recharge and all that fun slash tedious stuff <laughs> so yeah uh-oh i feel like my computer is feeling a bit more laggy than usual maybe because i didn't fresh i didn't give it a freshie it's been on for like since the morning When Zenith comes, I mean, it's going to rain gold chests for you, hopefully. Uh, I don't know how many people are actually going to push for the Zenith. It is pretty good, though. 15% archer defense is no joke. If you don't have the 10% archer health skin, then yeah, for sure. This is like creme de la creme. Which KD? I'm in search up. If you go search up um, in Alliance Log. No, not Alliance Log. In Alliance List, search up sv68 and then i should be there as an r4 add me i will add you to the group chat and then from there you could connect with mitch <clears throat> yeah, but yeah with these events the real person that wins is a uh, lilith for sure <laughs> what's abg abg is asian barbecue grill so like barbecue pork barbecue steak um barbecue chicken anything on the grill <laughs> is abg <laughs> wait how many barbarian kills does my richard have so far 153 okay that's kind of mid i, I might regret say making a stream because i want it to be a kind of short one but this richard is actually just not dying <laughs> let me know when you added me by the way like send me send me in chat um essay oh no uh, uh chain ah oh well it's a two-piece oh it's a three-piece it's not bad There's alliance. I hate it when it gives me the notification for alliance quiz. I already did this event today. Turning on PC. All right, no worries. That's what we're defining ABG as now. That was always the definition. I don't know about you guys. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> Are you booing my definition of ABG or what? <laughs> Or just booing ABGs in general. Facts. Boo! ABGs! Boo! <laughs> um... When are you gonna- when are you gonna get 1k? Bro, I've been streaming every day! I've been doing my best! I even made a video! Yeah, that, that video? It was so- it's kind of annoying. It reminded me why I rarely make videos. It's because like the editing and then the rendering and then the uploading like that process probably took as long as the stream yesterday like i went to sleep at like 3 30. it's kind of crazy stream more facts i should just like do a ludwig and just keep my stream on 24 hours a day right you guys would watch that you're not trying hard enough yeah try harder 
next next year, Mitch. Yeah, Panther said he's gonna be the first person to donate to me, so. He's a punk, he knows it. But he's like, why am I getting trash talked trash talked in my own chat? Please, I have low self-esteem. Um Hey yo, you guys are just giving me time to get ready for for the camera to look pretty and stuff. I haven't really been using it. Another 24 hours. This is disgraceful. I show up every stream and I still can't donate or sub. Are you on Twitch as well? I may help you get a few golden bundles. I'm not I'm not on Twitch. Um I've never I don't know. I I don't really go on Twitch myself, so I never stream there. But I appreciate the I appreciate the offer though. Um once we hit 1k I'll, <laughs> I'll look for you. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. It's only if you want to, of course. Everything, everything, I'm thinking about everything that comes from YouTube is going to go back to YouTube. So it's going to be better production stuff, um, better overlays, maybe some different music, um, emotes and stuff. You got to commission those. Um, and then, of course, like the content that I'm making, like ROK. Hopefully I could be su sufficient enough where, you know, I don't have to go broke from my own paycheck and my <laughs> portfolios and shit to, to pay for ROK stuff. I don't want to anymore. Maybe camp. Ayo. Hey, I told you 1k. 1k to KVK and there'll be face cam. 1k. <clears throat> but yeah. Um, I say just let me know when you add me. Ready to be a Kraken. Hey yo, I've been I've been I've been wailing it up the past couple of streams because of you guys. So I really appreciate the support. Even like you guys not giving me money, it's just like fifty subs. Like yesterday, I wailed up because of the the sub goal. That sub goal was only like forty. Like looking back at it, it was like forty something subs, which is still a lot. But I'm like, damn, I really spent like six hundred dollars to get forty subs. <laughs> I don't know. I didn't chain. But it's okay. I, I, it's really good for your account. This event, if you could buy the bundles, um, even the this desert track event is. I feel like if you buy the bundles, it's super worth for the gold heads for sure, and the mats, and and then you could f buy out the shop too. And you could get the gold heads from here. Oh, gold heads from here. Like it's definitely worth. But of course, if you don't spend, then you know just go to forty and go on your merry way. Auto will always be baby a baby krill. You already sent selfie to Laxus. We feel unloved. Yo, stop snitching. By the way, that Laxus was uh he's trying to get me in trouble. He was trying to get me in trouble on his stream. I did not send him a selfie. <laughs> but he he um his stream likes it uh likes cute people. So then he's like, yo, Plato's sexy. So then he, I could get more subs, and I got one more sub from him. So <laughs> works out. I'm subbed. Nah, bro. I didn't send him a selfie. I didn't send him a selfie. I don't even take selfies. The only pictures I take are like, cause my girlfriend wants wants to take a picture. It's like, hey, take a picture of this, take a picture of that. So. Bro, these chains have been horrible today. You gotta walk. You gotta walk this march. Oh, God. What the hell? <laughs> that wouldn't even chain. Ah! My ritual will never die, I swear to god. Oh, there's... I'm kind of nervous about these whenever I'm in this area. Because then there tends to be a lot of people around. My double C is finding more chaining spots in my Richard, which is kind of sad. But it's fine. Holy, my hospital's kind of full. About to zero myself chaining.
Do do do. So we got Lucerne and we got Crystal Quest. Damn. Yeah. Can I do this in this five chain? Probably not. Oh shoot. Maybe I should start from here. Whoops. Maybe I should start from oh no. Start from down here. I don't know why my Richard's going there. Kinda of choking, not gonna lie. Unsub Ed. Who's Ed? Who's <laughs> Damn, I guess if your name's Ed, you gotta unsub according to Mitch. But <laughs> How you guys been doing though? Um, how did you guys do in in your wheels? How do you guys do on your um? Wait, let me know how how you how far you went on your desert events. What bundles you bought? I'm kind of curious as to all that stuff. Cause yesterday my wheel went terrible, and then I bought the bundle and got to 200 235 so apparently like the best place to stop is like 360 that's when you get your last gold head chest but then if you want the all the mats you stop at 415 but i think if we max um I think we, if we max this daily bundle, if we see Moonlight Zephyrs, if we max this, we might be able to get the 360. I don't know. Actually, maybe not. I, I don't. I don't think it gives enough dice, right? I don't spin wheels. All my gems go towards equipment events. Yeah, that's fair. I spin wheels because I still need commanders. Um, but once you get your your solid commanders, then like I spin all my everything to ten. And then once the egg comes around, I spin that to like 100 if it's a blueprint I need. Only free spin the wheel, don't need any of those commanders. Stop at 2A2 in desert tracks, didn't get daily bundle. Speedos better than dude bundle. Yeah, that's true. Daily they, The daily bundle is actually super good. Maybe I should do a sub goal every day for daily bundle. Like if we gain 10 subs. I'll buy a daily bundle. <laughs> ah, that'd be funny. I'm like selling out for subs. I don't know what else to do for sub goals. Hmm. Plato already a kraken, but Lambo is a god on spending. True. I'm guessing that means he spends smart. Or like. He Plato or chat, I have Guan5112, Charles5512. Do I keep Charles or replace him with Leo and MG MG MGE him to five five one one? I also have expertise CPO slash five 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 three Alex. Although that's a hmm. Guan Alex is still pretty a pretty decent march. Um, CPO Relic Meth Meds is also pretty good, but I don't know. Maybe I, 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 that's actually a hard question. Fuck, I suck. I, every single time I see those, like, hey, I got this, I got that. I, I think it, it's like a math problem. <laughs> like, I look at it, it looks like a math problem, <laughs> and I'm like, shit, I don't know. <laughs> do it, <laughs> try it out, and then if their ports are bad, don't do it. <laughs> that's what I. But I mean, Guan Alex, CPO, Meth Med seems like a pretty decent like combination. Not gonna lie. Or what I did last KVK was Guan Meth Med Alex CPO, but that's cause like I was budget budget. Like I was, <laughs> I was brokeeth. But yeah, I mean, I just try out those combination of commanders. Cut the cut the Charles, and then see what, see how it goes from there. Yeah, no worries, no worries. Sorry I wasn't really able to give you a definitive answer. I kind of don't like doing that because I feel like it's really subjective on ba based on how you play and based on your like 
I guess your gear and your marches and all that kind of stuff. There's like a lot of factors going into commanders that we you can't just list out the commanders and have a black and white answer. There's always going to be differences in opinions and 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 uh, results and such. So, long well, nah, I had 175k gems and decided to buy out the VIP shop. Now I'm sitting on only 34k. I don't always spend my gems wisely. Man, that's like a first world problem. <laughs> I i don't think I've ever bought, like, I think I've bought some material, I think I've bought some materials during like, I don't know, more than gems from the VIP shop. Instead of that, like, oh, I bought the, I bought the, the boosts. I bought the boosts from the VIP shop. Outside of that, it's not, like I've never bought. I, I guess I bought some keys, like six of these keys to get 200 keys. And, and then that, that's it. But yeah, we'll get up there. We'll get up there. Can we craft anything? No. No worries. I understand. Yeah, I appreciate it. You can always send your reports in game. Um, I don't know if you're in the in-game chat. Anyone who wants to be in the in-game chat, feel free to add me on, on um, what do you call it? What game? On Rise of Kingdoms. Um, PM me, say that like, hey, I'm from the stream or whatever, or you could just say on the stream your, your name so I could add you. We're just having like a little chat where, I don't know, we're talking. <laughs> but yeah. Materials all speed up gold heads costly. They are, it is pretty costly, but if you, if you have the gem income, then for sure I, I would definitely at least the materials would be super good every every week, imagine. I've been using attack token boost instead of defense since we've been so aggressive. <laughs> hey man, get your kills by any means necessary, am I right? I respect that, I respect that. Oh yeah, only during MGE priority should be epic mats, blue mats, then speed ups. True. Yeah, I mean the mats are the mats are pretty good for sure. Um during more of the gems, I've been just gemming up VIP. Honestly, I want to hit, I want to hit 17 ASAP so I could get this all damage, um, and get this training speed, and then maybe like, like maybe in like 10 years, <laughs> make my way to VIP 18, and by then VIP 20 will be out. So, yeah. Hey, what's up, Georgia? Thank you so much, yo, Georgia. Shout out to Geor Georgia. He got me this enthusiastic farmer name. Um. Really, really appreciate it. I, I love it. <laughs> my, as you can tell, my past two streams has been enthusiastically farming. So, um, yeah, thanks for the, the thanks for the congratulations. I really appreciate everyone that's been supporting the stream and everything. It's been it's been amazing, honestly. Like I get off I get off of work and then we start. It's not even I don't even consider this a grind. It's just like I'm playing, but I get to talk to people at the same time. It's like kind of like a privilege, honestly. Yes. I won't go. It's okay. I won't go out and do that and bother you with my time. No, bro. Everyone, everyone's literally invited to the chat. It's, it's literally fine. Is this is this someone from the chat? <laughs> I got a friend request. I'm guessing it is. I'm just gonna add them. Put your player ID in this chat. Yeah, sure. What's my player ID? One and there you go. Eight one five five. I think that's correct. Eight one five five. Yeah. You get off at work. I got off at work. Oh, true. I mean, like, I work from home, so, <laughs> you know how it is, you know. All right, let him have that long chain. Um, let's see what's going on here. I mean, a, four, a 40 piece is not bad. If, if, if we can make it a 55, it'll be worth.
Bado the bot is updated. Yeah, I know. I told you. <laughs> I fucking told you the bot's updated. I've been asking if I could show it. All right. I got I got approval from our data team that I could show it. Touche. What do you do for work? I am communications, so... Actually, a lot of the stuff that I do for work is transferable to YouTube, so it, it works out. <laughs> like, editing videos is not the main thing I do, but it's a part of what I do. I can work from home. I can't work from home. I would get distracted so much. Honestly, I got distracted. Like, when KBK started, I got distracted so much, too. To where, like, now, this pa the past two days, I just don't even turn on my... My... My, what do you call it? Because I have a work laptop. I just don't turn on my desktop. Try to keep focus and keep focus on the work and that kind of stuff. And it's been working. I've been working pretty hard for the past few days, so. Catching up on all the slack and everything. <clears throat> but yeah, I do I do like social media stuff, website changes. Uh, I'm in communications, so. Added you. Chan dude. Oh, there you go. Let's get Chan dude in here. CW. CW diddy do. Sure. Um, I wish there was a search feature though. Or like add recent friends. Is there some some way to do that? Do, 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 do. I think I've like doubled my friends list <laughs> since uh, starting YouTube. So. There you go. Is your phone number? No, it's my governor ID. Is it the same amount of digits as a phone number? Let me check. No, it's not. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. Yeah, P's got one 4.1 bill KP. Yeah, that's normal. One of your many jumper accounts. I see, I see. Yeah, I added you. You're, you're in the chat. Um, I got Stody. Who's uh, who's this? <laughs> I'll, I guess I'll just add everyone. I don't think people would just add me for no reason, so it's <laughs> two numbers off from doxing someone. This plot of guys more KP than you, yeah, obviously. What do you mean, pro? Come on now, <laughs> I'm playing. Oh snap, Jake's in this chat too. Yeah, Jake's my guy. <clears throat> Yo, bro, I'm gonna expose you, I swear. <laughs> I'm playing, I'm playing. I'm playing! You can get top 20 this KVK. I, I bestow it upon you, you can take my spot. You can represent, uh... What am okay now are we? 2268. Pass opens for me at 1520 UTC. I'll post reports and chords if anything crazy happens. Yeah, that'd be great. Just add anything, man. Albert. Oh, this is definitely Albert, right? Let me ask. I don't want to, I want to make sure the people that are added to chat actually want to be there. <laughs> I, I just don't want to add random people that just like, oh, well, why am I here? You know? But yeah, there you go. <clears throat> How to turn tables. Yeah, we could look at the, we could look at the stats in a little bit. Bro, my, my Richard won't die, by the way. I'm trying my best. I think it hasn't lost health yet. Is there like a certain threshold where it just doesn't lose health to barbs anymore? I don't snitch. I didn't snitch yet. Okay, there you go. We got a we got a confirmation. Thank you for your consent. <laughs> oh, I should have added Albert first. Um, Albert Prime. There you go. Gonna be streaming for hours trying to kill him. True. I might just zero him in a city. Um, I'll find George's city and just put him, put the Richard in. 
Give George some free KP. But yeah, after this, after the Richard Chains finishes, I'm gonna show the, what our stats are currently looking like as a KD. Inside look at 2268s KD. All right, let's let's see. Um. Yeah, so we got. How do, can I make this bigger? How do I like increase the size? All right, it's fine. We'll do it like this. So this is the top twenty-five list updated. Um. September thirteenth, literally an hour ago. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. So these are pretty updated stats. Um, Peacemaker is at 13 mil deads. Second place is ABG Panda at 5.3 mil. And Schism at 5.2. Jacko at 5.1. Um, we got H Mahdi 12 at 4.2. Bomba at 3.1. Panther at 3.1. 6 at 3. B BMMR God at 2.9, Vel Vela Nada at 2.7, Ulul Pop at 2.7, Ken Corso at 2.6, um, The Homie at 2.5, Moninha at uh, 2.5, Kuzo 2.3, Nugget 2.3. I don't want to read everything. I I'm already halfway through, but you guys can see the names. <laughs> Um, I'm currently not up there. I'm at 1.1, I think, right? 1.2, 1, 1. so... My deads are definitely not up there. Most of those guys are actually garrison slash rally leads, so... I guess it makes makes like, a lot of sense. Some of them got zeroed. I, I don't know. Do you guys count zeroed people in there? Because I saw a couple names there that got, like... um I know Bomba got imprisoned, so... Hey, what's up, Giovanni? <laughs> Thank you so much. You're like the most frequent commenter, so commenter on my videos and my streams. So I really appreciate the support from you. Um, really means a lot. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that's our deads, and then our kills are looking like Peace is at 4.1 bill so far this KVK, and the close second is Z1 at 1.5, then Model Max at 1.2, Earl is at uh, 893 mil. Kex is at 874 mil. Um, we got um, Men Drangora at 845 mil, and then we got we got Alquad at um 770 799. Sam at 758. ABG Panda at 699, and AB your boy ABG Plato at 689 KP so far. This KBK. So that's the top 10. I'm in the top 10, baby. <laughs> Even though I haven't fought in a couple days, but yeah. Those are the stats. I can't zoom in on Discord. I don't know. How do you zoom in on Discord? <laughs> do, do, do. Uh-oh. But yeah, that's where we are currently at. Peacemaker killing it as per usual. This guy literally has <laughs> 13 mil deads and 4.1 bill KP for the KVK. So yeah, he's uh, he's definitely a war addict for sure. Yo, Pearl Panther, you guys, uh, are you guys free? Let's see. I'm over here with zero. I mean, I guess you guys haven't fought yet, right? So, don't worry, you'll, you'll catch up, you'll catch up. I'm gonna beat Peace and KP, right? <laughs> I see where Peace is in the rankings. He's... 
Yeah, he literally started at less than less than ten K. So here I work. Nah, it's chill, it's chill then, never mind. Type in chat, yo, I wanna I wanna know what your yearbooks are like. Cause I went through mine. We got like twelve bill resources gathered, like three thousand hours played. Um I wanna see what the average is, you know. How old is his accounts? He's a na he's like um he's a really young account. He's a he was from the same continent as KD. Um if you wanna check his uh his number, what do you call it? Oh wow, he's actually where is he in power? Oh he powered up. He is at Yeah, he's like that. <laughs> you could kind of estimate it with our kingdom age, and our kingdom is currently 517 days old. He's a bit older than that, so because he came from Kingdom um 1865. So yeah. Yeah, 90 mil. <laughs> He's pretty wild. I'll post mine in your chat. It's like free to play life. So, Plato, are you sure you don't want to migrate back to KV2K2? It'll be fun. I mean, this the thing about KVK2 that I don't like is... Uh, I don't know. The, the not being able to use SOC commanders is, is kind of off-putting to me. And then, like, every wheel and every event that you do... Except for, like, the material events. The material events are, are always prevalent. But, like... You know, every wheel, every MG, all of that stuff, like, you, you're losing value by not having the 10 spins for everything, so I don't know. I already went back to- I already played KVK2 twice. I think if I played it a third time, it'd be pretty tough, but... <laughs> appreciate the offer, though. I would be interested, but this KVK is too interesting for me to, to leave it. And this KD- I'm too comfortable in this KD, too. If I was un unsatisfied with this KD, then, you know... I might think about it, but... No way, I'm back from... You're back from 1865? He's from 2265, so... Did I say 18? I might have said that wrong. Migrate to me, we have a lot of ladies. Unfortunately, I mean, fortunately, I'm not looking, so. <laughs> but hey, apparently if you're single, go migrate to study. I'm Mitch. <laughs> you got Mitch's attention. <laughs> Looks like Mitch, Mitch is down. W stream, stuff to plot her right now. I guess I gotta add you. I've got a bunch of yearbooks in here. I'll, I, I, we could do a yearbook review if you guys want. Will the stream be done for yearbook review? You guys want to look through yearbooks? We could do like a quick recap of mine and then kind of compare the, compare the stats. I'm a lady lover, but I don't fight. You farm gems. True. <clears throat> You actually farm gems, Mitch? That's kind of crazy. Alright, let's go add... I wouldn't have thought Mitch as a gem farmer. I don't know. Oh, that's people added. I'm like, why can I not add this guy? This one, right? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Do it. <laughs> hey, if you have ladies like Kenny the Catfish, yo, I'll think about it. If it's not Kenny the Catfish or better, then it's it's over. You have to let me know. Where they pulled their Instagram pics from. As a free to play, I need to farm job. Yo, Mitch, you're not free to play, bro. Stop capping. 
I know for a fact you're not free to play. Sub to Plato. Facts. Sub to Plato. <laughs> but yeah, if you guys like the content and you're not subscribed, it'd be really, really appreciated if you can subscribe. We are doing this. Apparently, it's a marathon stream. I mean, the rich rate's getting low-ish. Look. It's at 43. It was at 50 before. So. It's getting there. <laughs> but yeah. Who that? I farm gems from start to finish every KVK. I, I respect everyone that has uh, the patience and time to do that. You guys are the real ones. I want to see I want to see your yearbooks and see how many hours you play. <laughs> but I guess I chains. So I can't really. But chaining, at least, you know, it's pretty easy to find barbs for, for gem nodes. Like, I look. And it just doesn't, like, the red. Oh, there's one here. But, yeah. Like, just looking for nodes is kind of tedious for me. I don't know. But I get why they don't have it as a search. Because it'd be just way too easy to get gems. And they'd always be full. My account is 20. Oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> you didn't even full play the full year and you got 2.2k hours. That's pretty impressive, man. Maniac's God. This guy's actually grinding out here. The best YouTuber ever. Alright. Let's see where. Let's go through. Um, I guess. Am I walking? The thing is, I want to keep chaining. Because if I don't chain, then the stream will never end. <laughs> and I want to go to sleep eventually. I just got muted from the system. Otherwise, I'd share mine. Yeah, no worries. She. So this guy's like toxic. <laughs> is Giovanni. Oh, yeah, for sure. Can I like add you from here? No. Mm -mm. There you go. Wow, um, I'm surprised. I've been so I've been like talking about this chat for a while, but I'm surprised like a, a lot of regulars are coming in now. So, but yeah, welcome, welcome. Be nice in there. <laughs> do, do, do. You've been. <laughs> My count is 1,140 days old, bruh. That's wild. How many years is that? Like three and a bit? I've been free to play since. Um, zero thirteen UTC. True. Hey, man, that's probably a an accomplishment for you. <laughs> Every time I go to a chat, like a, a Rise of Kingdoms chat, you're always there, and you're like, <laughs> you're always a member. This guy's a whale in Rise of Kingdoms and in YouTube. <laughs> because of the AP change, are you doing Marauders or are you just sticking to KVK barbs only? Um, I don't think the AP change really changes much as to my stance between Marauders and KVK Barbs. Um, like if you five, like the whole thing about me and Marauders versus KVK Barbs is if you chain, for sure KVK Barbs are just better value AP to AP to conversion, like what you get. But then for Marauders, if you five march swarm Barbs, then you might as well just do Marauders because you get more output. Hey, what's up, Rachel? Welcome, welcome. You changed your name, so it's okay. Wait, what was your original name? Let me know your original name. I might remember you. Let's go, Plato Prime. Is that the new commander coming out? Yeah, I watched his new Omni Arc video, and he said that there's a new commander coming out that's not um, Joan of Arc and uh, the other guy, but it's a KVK specific commander. And it was like an official, like official thing. So, not too sure what that was about, but 
pretty interesting. And I'm not gonna talk about Lambo. I, I see. I'm not. I'm honestly. I, I'm. <laughs> I don't really remember. I don't. Did I even stream a, a month ago? <laughs> I think I was in vacation. But I appreciate you coming back. I apologize not remembering you, but I'll definitely remember you now. Definitely. <laughs> Send you a chart for Crystal Tech. It's a website. Didn't know if you want it for Discord or anything. Um. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, okay. I'll take a look at it off stream. Um, you're not scamming me though, right? <laughs> I'm not getting a virus. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. Appreciate it though. Um, I'm sure people. Are you on the Discord, by the way? Um, Jared. Oh, I just finished watching that vid and brought me here. <laughs> And I was brought here. Hey, Plano. Hey, what's up, Quasi? Welcome, welcome, welcome. I think I saw you on Chiss's stream earlier. You stay in your king after KVK or did Redline recruit, recruit me? Redline recruited my whole KD, but hey, man. I'm, I'm a loyal guy, you know? Unless, you know. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I feel like I know the foundation of this KD really well, and that's why... Like, I'm pretty... I, I don't see myself leaving anytime soon. Of course, like, if things fall apart, which hopefully they won't, but, you know, you never really know how a KD will react after their first zone loss. That was the first time we ever lost a zone. Um, and we lost it pretty, like, pretty swiftly, so... <laughs> it's been kind of, it's been kind of, like, a little downtrot, but we're kind of, like, trying to patch the holes and, and, and like, um... <clears throat> see what see what we could do better as a KD. So, I'm gonna turn on the light real quick. <clears throat> Sorry if I like clear my throat a lot. I have some long COVID effects. Oh. <laughs> Omniarch is really on the bottom of the list to follow for leaks. Lol. I mean, he he translated from this uh. What do you call it? From this ROK Vietnamese thing. Like they had a Vietnamese ROK event and then they said that they're releasing those commanders, so <laughs> I don't know. Like I know I do know that there's some stuff that he says that like sometimes it's not like completely accurate, but I felt like that one like I'm not Vietnamese so I couldn't really tell. But he told but he said that it, that, those, that was a translation, so I'm like, okay. I mean we'll see. <clears throat> Omniarch is entertaining but 100% clickbait. Yeah, I mean he's he's pretty clickbaity but I mean I never get disappointed with the content so he's like I feel like he's like one in the after Chisco I think I subbed to him second honestly because I he was just he just uh he got those thumbnails and those titles and then when you watch the content it's like oh it's not actually that but then it's like oh you know it's still interesting so I mean obviously all you guys got clickbaited right with my beautiful thumbnails we got two buff boys Richard and Aunt May um duking it out <laughs> do do do. I'm fixing to go eat. I'll come back later. Redline is a bigger, is bigger noob than two from MySpace, <laughs> than Tom from MySpace. I'm loyal to Black Panther. Sheesh, Black Panther. Yo, Panther, you got fans, by the way. You see that? Let's go, my boy Az or I mean Jose, the or the the ancient one. It sucks being a water camp. We have to wait for another seven days or so to fight. Thankfully, we have someone to fight in past six. Yeah, you know, we made it so that you guys have someone to fight. That's exactly what happened in our zone five. We felt bad, you know, we had a solid 10 days of fighting with uh, 1802 of, you know, getting cheeseburgered and burning forts. And then we're like, hey, <laughs> let's bring them over. Let's bring the fun to our allies. <laughs> Drop some likes, ladies and germs. Headed to eat catfish and hush puppies. Alright, yo, 
Later, Mitch. Thanks for coming through. I guess I'll just settle for these two. XY skill. We, we have the same X. We had the same XY actually. That's funny. Max Y skill 5525 five, enough to open field or you must expertise him. I'm not a rally lead. Yeah. I literally just was using my XY at 5525 five, five earlier um, in the KVK. So I definitely say it's very useful. It's very usable. Um, that fifth skill is like really important. The expertise is really good, but I still use them at 5525. Five, five. I just got him at three because I did that desert event. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, I have, um, what do you call it? I got 7.8 mil kills off from him just from 5525, so I definitely say he's usable. Um, how do you get all your marches under one key? So, Georgia, what I do is when my, all my marches are together, there's this priest, there's like this, get, let me chain this real quick. But if you go into into the settings, I'll, there's like this um like formation. There's this formation hockey, and then I kind of just put them all under the same formation so that I could pop in and out of the flags like right in and out when I was cheese rigging with five marches. So when you go to form shortcuts, there's this. Oh, it stopped chaining. Anyways, oops, I can't. That's kind of awkward. Um, when you go to formation. Um, you press, what is it called? It's like shift one It's to add a troop to the formation. And then you press the selective troop with control one. And then every single time you press control one, all of your troops get selected no matter what, even if it's in a flag, even if it's in like whatever, whatever, a node, they all get selected. So, or if you want like to press all of your troops at the same time, you could press F1 for me. Um, the hockey is up here. Um, select all troops. But this one, if your troops are in a node or whatever, you can notice that my gatherers didn't get selected. Like, they're not lighting up over here. But if they were under... Say, like, I get this guy. Let's put him in there. Let's get this guy, put him in there. Put him there. Oh, shit. I'm not going to chain that. Oh, well. Put him there, put him in there. And then I think all my marches should... Wait, how did how did I do it again? It's actually drawn. Wait, is it working? Put it like that and then like that. Yeah. I think they all have to. I think it, they they have to be out of the open field and then you could do it. I don't think you could do it from in a node, but I don't know. <laughs> Hopefully you got the gist. <laughs> Maybe I should make a video on hockey's and how I cheeseburgered, but all right, let's see what else. Um, hi Plato. Recently, you did a good job good video on getting legendary commanders to four stars but what's the best way to max a fifth and sixth star for legendary commander that's a good question and i feel like for me i i think the best way would be to i guess we could do it with a commander here but commander would be a primary here i don't think any of these commanders would be a primary maybe flavius but I don't plan on using Flavius anytime soon. Hmm. I don't want to use stars on something that I'm not going to use. Anyways. Oh, I could do it for a perp. Purple commander. Yeah. So I feel like once you're at this point, um, you could just kind of like star it up with normal stars. I know some people use this. Like this... um. Some people use do it like this. I don't really see the diff. Oh shoot, I messed up. <laughs> but before you hit the next level, kind of just do the same thing. Because um like I'll do it with another commander. Let's do it with like um Let's do it with this guy. So I'm gonna bring him up to just before hitting five stars. 
you want to kind of be careful with these epics because they're pretty easy to to, to max. So like if this was a legendary commander, I'd like do this. Try to get it close to 99% as possible. There's no way it crit, right? Okay. Whew, I thought it crit for a second. And then from there, just hit this and then it'll give you the extra extra boost towards um But after this point it's still like you still just need a bunch of stars um i usually just when when i do it usually i just use all my gold stars from there my normal stars and then i save these ones for um when i uh i save these ones when i try to snipe the fourth skill or whatever but yeah hopefully hopefully that that answered your question not sure if I missed it how do you do in circus oh yeah um my circus i got speeds so i didn't make i didn't i didn't get any i didn't get anything good um i woke up and then i just saw this message i'm like oh, okay well i did i mean i got 24 hours of speed ups but i couldn't i didn't make the draw or whatever so unlucky you're still in nice i heard they are only playable for one mode i'm not too sure what Oh, the new commanders? Yeah, that's what I heard as well. Is this no way this is going to chain, man? Oh, oh wait, wait, this is fine. Zero AP. Um, yeah, I heard I heard they're from it just for one one mode. Is El Cid good for free to play? El Cid is not good for free to play. Um, any gold gold key commander? I feel like you shouldn't invest in. Um, and. Unless you somehow just accidentally maxed him from gold keys. <laughs> but El Cid is kind of like a really old commander that is unusable um, later on in the game. And then early on in the game, um, you shouldn't have him maxed anyways because you didn't have enough gold keys to max him. You know what I mean? So he's just in that weird spot. Like I, I know El Cid rallies, El Cid like Fred, Freddy rallies or something in KVK1. They like destroy people, but... After that, like, he falls off really, really hard. Like, I've never used Elsa in my life, so... Um... Okay, I'll try it, thanks. Plot of is any of my cards, could you rate my city decorations? Um... <clears throat> I could probably do that in between chains, sure. I guess Richard still hasn't died yet? Bro, my Rich is not even close to dying. <laughs> He's at 340. He started at 350, so it's gonna be a lot. I hope. Uh, I don't know how to. I don't know how to kill him. <laughs> I've just been chaining it up, man. Thank you for that. Thank you very much for taking the time to go through that. And yes, it answered it perfectly. All right, thanks. Um, I'm not. I'm honestly trying to work on enunciating and kind of. Um presenting my thought process in a, a lot more clear way. I don't really talk that much, so streaming has really made me more used to talking to people and such, so. Um, I'm on the third act, hopefully I reach act five. Third act? Wait, for this? The third act already happened? Oh, wow. It is on act three, wow. Hey, right, good luck, Martin. Hopefully you get that. Uh, I heard only three people in the game get a dagger, but you know, maybe you're going to be one of the three, right? <laughs> um, did you see what Chisco said about the wheel? He's trying to explain to people in chat. Seemed like they came to the conclusion that people have finished early have still chance for a dagger. Yeah, I saw that. Um, apparently, like everyone has... There's Out of everyone, there's a 1% chance of people to, to get into the, the bauble or whatever, whatever, so... Honestly, the way that they worded that event was super like hard to understand. So, if that's how it works, then that's how it works. I don't, I can't really interpret it myself. <clears throat> Elsa is great for his Mars speed if filling rallies for structures of arches. Yeah, I use actually. Yeah, you're you're right, Lambo. 
I use El Cid to, to fill. <laughs> um, it's good for the, the walk of shame whenever you zero city or zero flag and then you're walking back from, from, a, from a rally because you get, I believe, a solid... Yeah, 15% Archer March Speed, and I d does any other commander give Archer March Speed? Like, I don't think... God, maybe, does Edward give Archer March Speed? Son of Satan, I? Yeah. Oh, Edward gives a, a lot, actually, what the hell? But yeah. Archer March Speed is definitely, definitely good when you're coming from rallies, for sure. Circus wheel, or just circus, my bad. Oh, no worries, no worries. So far, I got my Charles to 5513, trying to skip garrison skill. Yeah, that's definitely the thing to do for open field. Getting that counter attack is super good. The garrison's like kind of useless, but eventually, if you do want to use them actually in SOC during open field, that extra march speed that you get from the expertise is probably like super necessary. Um, you still have a chance in circus. They have lucky four draw act to get into the finale. True. Wait, is it three people in the game? I thought it's three people. Three people in your kingdom. I think it's three people in the game. <laughs> I won't mind ten special legendary materials for sure, man. I I wouldn't mind any material. I just need materials, man. The materials are. One day, yeah, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be that guy that buys geared up every day. Trust. <laughs> Ramsey Smart also has March Speed in his third skill. Okay, so that's uh, all the marches that I don't have. All the... What is his third skill? Oh, 40% March Speed, wait. Sheesh, so if I'm filling, I should go uh, Edward Ramsey's. <laughs> but yeah. Let's see what we got going on. So, we're gonna check out Quasi City. I want you guys to also um, rate his... Rate his city with me. All right, two two nine four. You got Vox Quasi. You got that those fireworks popping. Got those city lights. Got Duke as well. So he'd be training. Okay, okay. You got. Your um your stuff spread out. Um wait, where's your so this is your cav, this is your I guess it's I guess there's some stuff missing, huh? There it is. I'm like, what was <laughs> why are there buildings missing? And so much open space. Okay, yeah, this is pretty sick. Um you have a lot going on here. You have a lot of different decorations going on. You got someone swinging. I don't even know where you got that from. Um I mean yeah, it's pretty cool. I like I like how, um, yeah, I like how everything's like connected. Like I like having the, the, the buildings so that you could just click them. Um, so having them throughout the city is a bit, is a bit, is a bit tough. Cause you have to click here and then you have to click up here. Um, but that's just me being lazy. So, <laughs> but it's pretty cool. You got the gold tiles showing, showing how rich you are and everything. I give it a solid, I give it a solid eight. I give it a solid eight. It is a lot better than mine. <laughs> I need to I need to hire someone to, to make my layout, I swear. Hire them from Fiverr or something, because my layout is lacking. I really like it. The thing is I feel like there's a lot to look at, you know what I mean? Um but then again, I work <laughs> I work like when I work I do corporate stuff and it's like very simplistic, so well, not, not like this simplistic, but it's kind of like, um, <clears throat> like sometimes have like having a theme with it would be kind of cool. You know what I mean? Like there's like some Halloween stuff and then some, I don't actually don't, I don't remember, but like there's like some contrasting stuff. Again, I, I don't I don't feel like I have any right to judge anyone's city um <laughs> anyone's city layout because literally my lovable maverick uh, wow are you like top gun whoops I didn't mean to do that 
Wait, let me just chain this real quick. We got Mr. Lovable Maverick from Top Gun. That's I like I like the the flag that you got going on over here. That's pretty cool. I like how your your civilization is red. I don't know if you did that on purpose. Kind of like represents the the, the Georgia theme. Um, but yeah, I, I I like the simplicity. I'll give it. Although like it's pretty practical. Um, I'll give it a solid like seven out of ten. You have kill event vid. Um, I'm not too sure what you mean by kill event vid. Like, um, kind of like a recording of a kill event. I'm not too sure what kill event you're, you're referring to either. <clears throat> the gold flag is really cool. The gold flag is really cool. I'm actually like, I didn't get that achievement yet, by the way. Um,. The special snowflake one because I didn't get the 130 king roadblocks. I just couldn't find the gems to do so. I'm like, yeah, that achievement's for whales because we're like really creative minds that could actually use 130 king roadblocks effectively in the city. Because, like, obviously, my city is you know, I don't even use roads, so <laughs> everyone walks on grass. <laughs> We don't have roads in my city. <clears throat> really adds to the ancient vibes. Yo, that's ex yo, that's exactly. How'd you know? That's what I was trying to do. <laughs> We're so far back that we don't even have roads. That's actually the vibes. Um, My Richard is not dying, guys. I I'm going to purposefully hit three at a time. My, my double C is dying like crazy, though. <laughs> I know he's dying like crazy. Let's see what's going on in this pass over here. I know Red's streaming, so maybe I could steal some content from him. Um, probably rallying this right now, if I had to guess, judging from from the the posturing of of their marches. <clears throat> oh my gosh! Look, yeah, <laughs> I knew they'd do that. <laughs> Could be over here too. They actually have a lot of forts healing at the same time, which is pretty interesting. I wonder if does this fort actually block? I don't think it does, right? Like they could mountain hop through here and go through here. Oh, but they got forts back here. Never mind. <laughs> They're good. They're good. They got forts back here. <laughs> they thought about it. But yeah. They need to nerf force them out. I agree. What I was saying is that they have skillful they have skillful craftsmen where you could build stuff faster. Maybe they should have skillful arsonists where you burn stuff faster. <laughs> you know? Pop skillful arsonist. But I do I do think having a fort like a stronghold is a good idea in the game that takes like a like a cup like a little bit of a day to to burn down but i feel like it should be more rare you know what i mean maybe like like forts are the same but then there's only one that has the same amount of health as the others you know what i mean like it's just like a stronghold um i don't know yeah the fort meta is ridiculous we we went through it literally in our zone um in our zone five so 
Where's I zone 5? I zone 5. So, yeah. It really sucked. Hey, yo, what's up? What's up? You changed your name. Let's go. What's up? What's up, Rezo? I feel like they need to burn without healing in about 12 hours. Yeah, 12 hours is pretty good. Um, I guess that's why King's Zone is pretty fun, because you can't just fort drop everywhere. Um, He's got it all set up. Nice, nice. Yeah, just if you guys saw it on our Discord, um, <clears throat> Rezo was one of the Rezo hit me up. He saw me from YouTube and he asked me how to get started. So he's gonna be streaming tomorrow. If you guys want to check out his stuff, <laughs> um, he's gonna be streaming. What what KVK are you in? I'm not too sure exactly the details, but yeah, it's pretty cool that um, I'm at that level. You know that <laughs> people could ask me for advice. <laughs> I felt pretty humbled by that, for sure. Twenty ten said they have enough credits for a thirty five fort, so it should be boring. Interesting. I, I guess we could t t take a look. Um, let's see one one. Right. Oh, I gotta add chords too. One one. Probably has fog. Oh, okay, never mind then. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, if you guys need to contact me for help or anything, like contact me on Discord is definitely the way to go. <clears throat> Wait, are you guys from the same KD? <laughs> Oh, that's that's <laughs> that's crazy. All right, Rezo's gonna be streaming your KVK, Jeremiah. <laughs> yeah, let me let me link his channel. I've had pl plenty of streamers and such shout me out. It's time to do time to give back the favor to the rise of kingdoms community let's go subscribe to my boy rezo if his if his content's trash uh it's not my fault he's new <laughs> but yeah I'm, I'm sure it'll be pretty entertaining i'll be tuning in tomorrow as well so you, so you could definitely catch me in this chat Mm. Hey man, these new content creators, us new content creators are popping up like uh, like like dandelions right now. So it's nice to see. Yeah, man, spread it, spread it around your kingdom, spread it around your friends. That's what I did. Um, I hit up my, I hit up my homies. I'm like, hey, yo, like, put it in, like, cause like, I got, I didn't put it really. I put it in like, cause I was, I used to be an officer. I, right? I'm an officer, so I put it in kingdom officer chat or like my, king, my alliance officer chat. Like, yo, watch this video, and they're like, yeah, that's pretty funny. They started, they started subbing, and then from there, like, people saw that I was subbing, like. I was uh, streaming and stuff because of my Discord, and then it just went up from there. <laughs> true, true, true. Don't worry, I don't... Is there anyone from 2110 here? I don't know. That's cool. I literally had... um When I was streaming the other day, my whole stream was literally 1664. It's pretty funny because I looked at my analytics for the past, um, <laughs> for the past, like, week or something. And then my, it's usually, like, you know, 20% American and then, 
like, I don't know, like 9% Indo. But then during that week, it was like America got taken over by the Indonesian percentage. So it's always fun to look at analytics for sure. I'm the one person at 51 plus demographic for YouTube analytics. Let me check. I don't think there's one person. I think there's like... Um, analytics... Audience... Oh no, yeah, it's it's definitely more than one person. So there's 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 someone else there. <laughs> but yeah, you're 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 a veteran of the game, so it's really nice to uh, have you in the stream, Lambo. I saw you talking about oh well with with um what do you call it. <clears throat> With Bulba and everything, so. Hmm. But yeah, my apparently my viewers are. Guess how much percentage are female? <laughs> Guess how many? Guess the percentage of female viewers. Um. Oops, that's kind of awkward. Four percent, two percent, point point zero five percent. Okay, that's a point zero five percent. Um, let me check. Filters, gender. Alright, so my percentage of female viewers is apparently 1.1%, which is better than before. I was at 100% male before, so <laughs> that kind of hurt because that meant my girlfriend wasn't watching me, but you know. Where's Mitch? I haven't seen him, Plato. He, uh, he, went, to, he went to eat out. He said he would come back later. He, he's going out to eat, so... Um. <laughs> yeah, those are pretty old kingdoms. Oh, totally off topic, but what are your thoughts on hunting? Ever plan on doing something like that? I've never gone hunting before. Um, but hey, man. Um, I feel like it could be pretty enjoyable. Um, really depends on, like, I'm not, like, I don't have, I don't really have a stance on it. <laughs> I've never gone, <laughs> um, but, you know, if that's something you like to do, then, you, you know, you go for it. Ten thirty nine was White Tigers. I was there when Talmar got zeroed in KVK2. Yeah, the most viewed Rise of Kingdoms YouTube video in... Most viewed video in Rise of Kingdoms history on Chisco's channel right there. Dude, I started six months after that. It's not 800. Nightbot's trolling. Nightbot. It's 850. Let me fix that real quick. Nightbot. Fucking. Nightbot. There you go. Timers. Don't forget to sub. Edits. Submits. There you go. Yo, Plata, can you check out my CD loud? Trust me, you won't get disappointed. Alright, yo, after the, after this chain, after this chain, I'll, I got you. 
10:52 was the season three OV one team one league. True, true, true. I think I remember you talking about that, Tavolba. Um, dude, I started six months after that. Now I'm chilling in MF with MF and the TSN crew in 10:29. That rich is really strong. Yeah, my rich is not dying, man. <laughs> I'm literally hitting 52s and a 49, getting spit roasted, and this guy doesn't care. He's just taking it. MF is a nice guy for real. Wish he played more. Never been hunting either. Saw Joe, Joe Rogan and some show and made me want to go hunting. <laughs> I'll go hunting with a bow. Damn, this guy's Katniss out here. Katniss Everdeen. I'm the most humble guy too, not really under really understand the game, which is rare for a mega kraken. True, true, true. Yeah, some people just like they usually just like, you know, smack their wallets around and and win the game, but when you get a kraken that actually knows how to play the game and takes time to understand it, that's when it, they become really scary. Playing Mavic tomorrow, so I know what you mean. Yeah, I saw some other guy go hunting elk with a bow, it was really Interesting to see, also beautiful. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I think I think hunting is definitely. I feel like I'd be pretty proud to to catch something. You know, it's like, oh, this is the way of our ancestors. This is how they used to live. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's like, let's go. If a zombie apocalypse happened, I could catch myself an elk. You know who MF is? Yeah, I think um, um, Lambo and uh, Mitch told me. I mean, Mitch told me with Lambo in the chat about how he's like a really big, he's a really big whale. It's like a whale's whale got like a ton of deads, like a billion deads or something. Not not actually a billion, but you know, a shit ton. Ancestral something I respect. Yeah, for sure, for sure. I really like zombie games, so sometimes I just think to myself, I'm like, yo, if a zombie apocalypse happens, like, I'd be so fucked, huh? <laughs> So. <clears throat> I feel like it'd be cool to like create your own meal from start to finish, you know what I mean? Like from the production of catching the goods to um you know, preparing it and then cooking it and eating it. Shit, he almost has a build dead though. <laughs> and he has that's a crazy amount of resource assistance. Man, that guy's crazy. What the hell? How do you even get that many resources? Bruh. <laughs> but yeah. Seems like from you from what you guys are saying, you guys are chill guys and you say he's a chill guy, so um yeah. That's that's an insane amount of resource assistance, bro. That's <laughs> that's crazy. Crazy. And I will see. <laughs> Why does he not have that? Did he like miss it or did he didn't play during that time or what? <clears throat> he missed getting it. Ah, oh, shit. Well, I don't have that emote either, so. I barely have any emotes, so it works out. Since my account's really new. Wow, you guys know the history of Razor Kingdoms pretty well, huh? I mean, obviously Lambo. But Rezo, how much have you been playing?
Yeah, that's pretty chill. We had, I think we had a couple people in this kingdom like that too. Like they're like, yeah, we're gonna pop off our KVK and we'll come back. So. I feel like as a KD, you shouldn't hold people hostage. You know, if they want to leave, then might as well let them leave. And if they want to come back, you know, let them come back. No hard feelings, right? Lower seat KVKs, I see, I see. Oh, you gotta go, HMH. Thanks for the advice. Have a good rest of your stream. Wish the best. Thank for everyone else in chat. Good night or good morning, depending on your location. Yeah, I'll see you later. Oh, by the way, I was supposed to check someone's city, right? Wait, where's that? Oh, um, Martin. All right, my bad. I forgot. I actually forgot. Let me stop this chain real quick. Um, let me just bring the march there and then I'll look at Martin City. C11 5T2 T10 Let's see. I remembered. Sub to Pl sub to Pluto. <laughs> oh, that's really yo, I'm so sorry it took me so long to see this, bro. <laughs> I did get a screenshot. That's that's funny. Um This guy literally pushed everything to the side to to make that sign, man. I really appreciate that. <laughs> that that made my night. <laughs> hopefully Martin hopefully Martin you were here to see that. Whoops, spell you're wrong. I'm trying to grind up a little bit to be like Plato. It's a rather new account actually. True. He was at a famous KVK there, right? 1401, 636, and 1412. Guys, I talk about these famous KVKs. Maybe this one will be one. Nah. <laughs> I'm playing. This is the biggest KVK I've been in, though, so. Yeah, holding people hostage just creates rogues, though. Yeah, it's just that, and then, like, I don't know. Like, if it's in the middle of KVK, then, you know, I might get it. But if it's, like, off-season and they want to go, like, just let them go. Like, middle of KVK, the only thing is, like, they do have matchmaking power. You, I feel like you're, like, just promote that you're allowed to leave, but then after matchmaking, like, make it clear that, like, you know, you're expected to at least contribute and then you can leave. I feel like that's pretty fair. That's pretty fair. What's the best best archer march in KVK two and three? The thing about archer marches in KVK two and three is that um the the new archer commanders that you get unlocked, which is um which is uh, what do you call it? Edward and Tommy. I mean Tommy's still pretty good, but like you don't want to invest in Edward because he falls off like like off a cliff after KVK two and three. Tommy's still pretty good. Um, I feel like what people use for KVK two and three is yeah, watch well, Tommy for Garrison is pretty good. Ed and Tommy, but the thing is, I wouldn't invest in Ed at all. So, <laughs> um, I don't know. I didn't. I just didn't even use archers during KVK two and three. <laughs> To be honest, um, I just use Alex with my YSG and then I don't even know what I, I think I use Saladin with Ethelfled and then Alex YSG and then 
Charles with like Sun Tzu or something. I don't really remember, but YSU Mathmed is also really good. Yeah, the thing is, it's super super squishy, so you just have to be really careful. <laughs> like that thing pops if it gets swarmed. But that's a, that's a, like every march in Rise of Kingdoms, but m more of that than than other marches for sure, because there's no defensibility at all. You don't even get the 20% health relic bonus because there's no relics, right? So. <clears throat> I've seen a report from me hitting a YC meth med, I'll never use it. Yeah, I mean, if you target it, it's just like gonna get melted, especially if you have like an art, like a calf march. It's, just, it's gonna melt so fast, man. And the thing about YSG is if anyone sees it in the open field, they just instantly target it, right? They don't even think like, oh, fuck YSG, let's just kill that thing. Like, it's just implemented into people's minds to, to swarm down a YSG. So. But yeah, we actually pulled off that YSG Tommy Garrison in our KVK too. It, it went really well. And I can see the merit of Ed Tommy, but I, just, I can't recommend anyone investing in Edward. Like every single person I've I've ever talked to that Max Edward, they're just like, yeah, see unanimously like I I regret it. <laughs> so. <clears throat> I mean, my Richard's at three ten now. I've been kind of reckless with him. I I, I could have definitely made the stream longer. Um, by keeping him a bit healthier, but yeah, he's he's definitely getting lower now. <laughs> oh, there's a gem node. Oh, someone's farming it. See, I'm telling you, every single time I see a gem node, there's always someone in it. <laughs> it's high prio, bro. High prio. Alright, I kind of want to look through my yearbook for a little bit. Just skim through the stats and everything. I'm going to write it down on a notepad. Oops, notepad. On the side over here. So that we could kind of compare and contrast our stats. So I was on 365 days, so every day. And for... That amount of hours. I don't really care about this. I killed eight eight six is it barbs. Holy stites. Gathered twelve bill resources. Peerless Scholar, 258 Peerless. Alright. Oh, kills. I didn't see kills. Where was kills? Man, do I have to go through this cutscene every time? Please. Kills. Oh, there you go. It's here. Eight eighty eight mil kills. It's I mean, it's, I don't know if that's too good or not. 
88.6 mil kills. Gems used. Where's gems used? Can I go back? Bro, I can't. Oh, what is this? Bro, I'm not social apparently. Look, I'm nine social. <laughs> Use 1.8. I'll, I'll use that number 1.8. Let's go. And 1.8. I don't know what that is. Why did I say 9.8? 1.8. Gems. Check my DMs. I'll check in a bit. Let me just find a chain spot. Because this Richard's essentially my timer. <laughs> the faster I kill is Richard. <laughs> the faster the stream ends. Kill him! Kill him! Oh yeah, that's a pretty nasty report. Um, what KVK is this? It's KVK uh, 2? KVK 3? There's no way someone's using Salad and Khan in SOC, right? KVK 3, I think. Yeah. That's insane. Richard's been living for three hours. Richard's been out for like the whole day. <laughs> this Richard's been out since last night. <laughs> So, yeah, uh, I mean, I haven't been training continuously, so there's that, right? Um, but yeah, he's been out for a while, for sure. No, my chain! Wait, is this? Now you basically made a jumper. Have to make a jumper and control a temple if you want a KVK2. Yo, this guy offered me a KVK2. It's kind of crazy, but I don't know. I'd rather play SOC, to be honest. But going back for one KVK where I'm T5 would be pretty interesting. Because I went back for a KVK2, but I still T4. I was like fresh out of my KVK3, went back for KVK2. And I felt like it was just on par with everyone. I feel like if you're T5 in that KVK, especially if it's like a low seed, imagine. Oof, that's gonna be like farming kills, honestly. Oh, cringe. Reset. Woo, resets. Worth it, Max Pakal Herald? Worth it, Maxing Pakal Herald? Um. If you were to talk to my war leads, they'd say no. Simply because a Pakal Herald, for it to be useful, it, dep it 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 uh it really relies on your opponents making mistakes. Um, there's a lot better commanders that you can invest in, like CPO, like Guan, like like um Nevsky, like Budica, like Joan. That might come out soon. Um. Like, those commanders are, I would probably, like, those skill damage commanders that could actually, like, where you determine how effective it is based on your positioning and based on how you fight. Instead of um having a commander that, essentially, Pakal Herald, what, what it is, is it's really tanky, and but it only does damage if they t attack you back. If they don't attack you back, then your your march is kind of just, like, uh, just just there. It's really good for, for um, what do you call it, if you're losing KVK. And you're cheeseburgering in enough cities for sure, but instead of that, there isn't really much of a use. Yeah, reset, go, go, go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna reset my, I'm gonna go do a hard reset after this chain for sure. And I didn't say this, but we're gonna do, do finishing our Boudicca wheel. So that should be exciting. Hopefully I actually get an eight spot this time. 
And I got super, super unlucky last yesterday, so. Hopefully it'll be a bit better. Just a bit, just a smidge. All right, that's training. Let's do a quick reset. It is a Wednesday in Rise of Kingdoms time, so there's no Olympia. Oh yeah, there you go. Rezo with the facts. It doesn't really help your... Yeah, people call it like a selfish march because it just gets you KP, but it doesn't clear the field or win you objectives or anything, so... That's what I've been told, at least. But yeah, if you guys like the stream, I'm sure most of you are subscribed already, but it'd be greatly, greatly appreciated if, you know... You could subscribe. <laughs> did you ever do sports in high school and college? I used to be on the high school swim team. I did, uh, I did 50 free. No, I did 100 free. I did 50 fly. And I did a uh, medley. I got Edward. Nice. <laughs> Only one of the people I play with run for call Harold and got 30 mil kills with it. Yeah, I heard also just Harold with um, Alex, Alex Harold, and then you just go in, in and out of cities over and over again and just cheeseburger like that. I heard that's pretty fun too. And I was honestly like, whenever I spin, that's why whenever I spin um, infantry wheels to 10, I just try to spin my, my Harold. Um, just, you know, maybe I could get him usable one day maybe one day i'll become big enough of a whale where i could backtrack and invest in harold but yeah if you want a cheeseburger march like alex harold would probably be best because you could even use him open field but i don't know infantry is not it nowadays like in the 1254 discord someone called them glorified siege or something or i think that was a chat but yeah they they hate on <laughs> on infantry a lot over there so um <clears throat> Heart's Desire is on my kitty. Any advice if you played it? Yeah, um, some advice that I was told is before you select the commanders you want, um, if you only want certain, like, like, don't pick commanders that you won't invest in. So, for example, you could pick five commanders, but if you already have an expertise commander that you could choose, if you draw the expertise, you actually get your key back. So then it's easier to do your 200 keys that you need for your crystal quest or whatever. So the advice is pick like one to two commanders. Like it's either you pick one to two commanders that you want to work on or you pick commanders from MGEs and stuff that you don't have unlocked and you just try to unlock them. There's like multiple ways to play the event, but <clears throat> um, it really depends, Jared. If you have any commanders in Heart's Desire that you want to work on, then I would suggest just picking like that commander and then putting every other commander that you choose as something you've already expertise. So that if you draw another commander, you could just reuse the, the key. But then if you have, if you don't really have a particular commander to work on, or if you'd rather just unlock commanders, um, then I'd probably just, um, yeah, just pick the commanders you want to unlock and just spin from there. Also, another thing is, so, um, if there's an MGE commander that you want, you should probably work on, and like you're planning on expertising or working on throughout that KVK or the next KVK or so, um, probably pick them because you could get MG sculpts for, for pretty easy on, um, in that event, so. But yeah, that's, that's pretty much my advice for Heart's Desire. Hopefully that was pretty understandable. How oh, nice, swimming is fun. Yes, I love swimming because it was like, it was like cardio. But like if it built your muscles too, it's like it, it it works out everything. So like it's like an all in one <laughs> workout. Yeah, it works too. What do you think? When do you think I can use Boudica with a max YSG? 
I was told 5551 is good for Boudica, but I don't even know what her third skill is. Oh, that skill ta damage taken reduction is pretty huge, yeah. So like 5551 is how I'm using her, and she seems to be doing pretty well, so I, I, I could just suggest the same thing. M sucks, choose the good commanders. Do you think 5551 Boudica and 5511 Nebu or 551 Boudica slash Max why she is better? That's a good question. I don't even know what Nebu does, and I haven't used Nebu previously, so I'm probably the wrong person to ask. Um, you get the march speed, you get defense, you get damage factor. Hmm. Is there? Where's the anti swarm on this guy? Oh, it's this counter damage. So it's. I'm. I don't know, man. The the circle AOE is just super attractive to me. Even though it's like a half circle for for Nebu. But you do get extra defense, so it makes it tankier. That's a good question, guys. What do you think? I'm not too sure. I only have max activities to pick out of. Thanks, man. Oh, no worries. Nebu for speed. And nice AoE. Why she will make you... F there you go. That's that's probably good advice, actually. Why she would do more damage. Good thing about why she too is like, like, like how I'm chaining Barbs. You could chain Rage. A lot easier with a circle AoE, but at the same time, like, why would enemies be behind you? If enemies are behind you, then that means you're just mispositioning your Archer March in the first place. So probably the Nebu would be better, in my opinion. But yeah, I'm not, I'm not too sure. It's just a very close, like. <laughs> I say YC because I have a YC, but you know, Nebu, like the extra defense from Nebu would probably be pretty good. Um, like you get March Speed, you get arch extra movement, and then you get damage factor. Yeah, that's. <laughs> you're making me think. You plan on maxing your Boudica one day? Eventually, one day, I just want to make sure that I have enough sculpts for this new commander that might come out. Um, one, because it's pretty good clickbait. Um, and then two, because uh, if Joan, if the Joan leaks are real, then it looks pretty broken. So, but definitely, like, I'm gonna spin this wheel, and then this, I'm gonna spin this wheel for for Boudica to to 100, and I'll probably do that for most of my like all my archer wheels because I don't really. I think I need any of these commanders at all, so I think Boudica is probably best in slot for for um the wheel. TBH inventory equipment is just made to be worse. What about infantry? Like how it has like no health and such? Yeah, I mean, Cav is super stacked with health. This is gonna make my Richard go down, by the way. Let's go. <laughs> but yeah, um, Cav is stacked with health. I feel like the, the Archer set's pretty good, but the Imp set like is <laughs> kind of lackluster for sure. Counter attack damage only for rallies. Yeah, I already read the Boudicca one. Just go for Archer MG. I'm sure you did enough contribution in the KVK two Plato. Lol. I mean, yeah. I mean, MG MGs are pretty good. Um. Like if you want a Nebu, like what? You know, what do you get? You get Nebu. You get Artie, like for for Boudica. But I don't know. I'm content with my Boudica YSG for now. We'll see. We'll see what happens though. Last time I applied for Amp MG and I got second. I also like I got. I actually have um. I could show you the MGs that I got throughout the off season. My males. Um, why did I, why did I save these? Let's delete, delete. <laughs> why did I save these? Kind of random. But the line flag ones for sure I'll save. Um, where is it? Where's MGE? Oh, I saved the fort reward adjustment. <laughs> Protective the supplies. There you go. I got second place for 
I got second place for what you call it leadership mg and then i got second place for um inf mg and then just want flavius i eventually want to get flavius one day i'm just gonna slow slowly work on him if i ever become a, a garrison lead if i ever become that form of spender i feel like i feel like i, I just feel bad for people that garrison and <laughs> i don't know just cover for them a little bit you know give them an, another option I feel like you could never have enough garrisons in the KD, so. <clears throat> if you're so easy to get, yeah, it really is. Like you get the pants from whatever, you get the pants from the KVK, you get the boots from KVK as well, like. Although I don't, I don't usually use she Shios, I usually use the, the set boots, so. Where are the barbs? Where are the barbs? Let's see what my rich is at now. Sheesh, he's less than 300. He's getting there. He's actually getting there, guys. Soon. Rich to... Hard to get MGs in Fat A Kingdom. Yeah, it, it's pretty hard. Um, in this, in this KVK, in this kingdom, it's... I mean, they do it by contribution and stuff, but like... They don't want the same people to keep getting the same MGs over and over again, so they kind of penalize. Um, give you penalty points for each MG you win in the off season, which makes sense. But because you want to, you want to spread out your rewards too. Like, you, like not you don't want only your top fifteen fighters to get rewards. You want like you know everyone that actually contributed. So, but yeah, Budoka wheel stars. Okay, don't really need stars, but. Oh, literally every single time I get building speeds, I never get the Boudicca heads. Research speeds, not useful. Look, it's like teasing me. It's like you'll never get an eight spot. But then watch it get an eight spot here right now. <laughs> I really thought, I really thought I caught it. That'd have been a clip worthy moment, but nah. We're gonna be spinning this to 100. I'm not a whale that spins past 100. Um, I might even spin it to 99 and just wait for the free spin and the half spin off tomorrow to get it to 101. That's what I usually tend. That's what I tend to do. But yeah, we'll see how our how, how our luck is today. And it's looking like pretty unlucky or mid luck right now. I keep getting. Yeah, this is trash so far. Okay, that's okay. That's good, but then give me the eight spot. Oh, let's go! Let's go! We got our first eight spot of the wheel. Yo, Rezo just making me feel bad after looking at chat with uh, the eight spot with the free spin. But hey, you know I'm not gonna I'm not gonna compare myself to others. You know we got. I'm just happy the Lilith Gods finally got me an eight spot for Boudicca Prime. <laughs> we take those Ws, and then we just get another one, back to back. Nah. My wheel like used to be really good actually. I used to make videos on my wheel. Um Yeah, but that was a really bad spin though. Okay. Good start. Don't need wood. Eight spot, eight spot, eight spot. Okay, uni, we'll take a uni. Three three sculpts. That's pretty like break even, right? Oh my, my last spins. Of course my last like spins is gonna be trash, please. Oh my god, what is this? Bro, what is this? I don't need any of that. I prefer maybe the gold, but gosh. Ah, right, this is it, this is it. No. Okay. Okay. Oh, <laughs> we got another eight spot. Alright, that might have saved our spin value for this thing. Like, we might have broken even with the wheel this time because of that spin. Holy. We take those. Yes. Sal Salman knows. Let's go. Let's go. And then tomorrow we'll get the free spot and get the 15 sculpts. All right. 
I'm happy with that. We got no eight spots yesterday, but we got two today with less spins. So I'll take I'll take that. I'll take it. I'm signing spoils. Sheesh, got those gem gemmies. Um, it's six six ninety scalps of SM to XP into Boudica, or spend three ten to finish my Artemisia. Yo, what's up, tired tired Leon? Um, it really depends on the situation you're in. I wouldn't spend heads at all if you like if you're going into a pass. Then for sure, I'd probably just wait before I speak. Let me look at Artemisia's skills. I don't even know what she does. I don't, I don't even have her. So, probably the wrong person to ask. But. <clears throat> um. Oh, okay. That's increased 50% all damage. Ooh. <clears throat> what does her expertise do? Normal attacks. Have a 10% chance of dealing extra damage per second and cause them to take extra to deal extra skill damage. Interesting. The thing is though, if you if you expertise your your Artemisia. Yeah, who are you gonna pair it with? Because you need an expertise Boudica for that pair to be really good. Because the expert Boudica expertise kind of counteracts the self silence, and that's why people love that pair so much. But if you don't have an expertise Boudica, then you're just gonna be silenced, and it's not gonna feel that good. Because you want your Boudica skill to to proc like a ASAP. The more it procs, the more times that your murder ball will do extra skill damage. So it's a that's it's a really tough question because. Like if you're not in a KV, if you're not in a KVK and you're not about to fight right now, I just say save it and see what the meta is once you get into that situation. But if you are in a KVK situation, then like <laughs> I don't know. I'd I'd rather I'd rather get the the Boudica. It's more flexible. Maybe like five 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 one Boudica and then try to Yeah. There you go. Lambo with the the advice. Whenever people ask me about archers, I'm like, bro. <laughs> I am so sorry. I'm not an archer guy. But yeah, I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. 850 subs before the bundle expires equal to Moonlight Zephyr. You, got, you have Tommy at 5135. I mean, yeah, Tommy. Already Tommy's pretty good, right? I think she is usable at 5115. <clears throat> Might be was like five, five, one, five, five, ideally, but five, one, one, five is still pretty good. Who calls the lion heart? Oh, mm. yeah, my, those Tommy skills are pretty ugly, by the way. <laughs> like mine are. It's just like two, 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 two. <laughs> it's pretty bad. Pretty bad. Yeah, or if all you want is uh skill damage debuff, I was told five 
5115 is also okay. But yeah, I mean, the synergy there is that with the self silence, your Tommy gets to stack more before it procs, so. Can't believe my Richard's still alive. <laughs> He's like healthy too. But it's slowly getting down there. As soon as they as soon as you get four March swarmed, like it tends to go downhill from there. Oh I gathered resources a lot, apparently. <clears throat> Oh, I don't need wood. Food, give me food. Oh, that's my gold gathering march, though. Give me gold. Alright. Richard is down to 260. It's like un an unexpanded march now. It's getting yellow. Okay, okay. It's kind of crazy that Cat Commander is going to come out. Man. I'll we'll have to bench my salad in. Or, or, we could um <laughs> have three Cat Marches. Because <laughs> people are saying, or Drago, when I was watching him earlier, he was saying that Jones' pair is going to be Nevsky. But then I was trying to get my Nevsky with my... William. So I'm kind of like, where do I put my William if I have my XY? Current Archer Marches are Max Ram, Max YSG, RD 5524 with 513 Tommy. So I DK if I should finish RD off or put Booty Pit to 5551 or something. I like her too. Um. TBH you do XY Nev Joan William. Joan primary with William. Interesting. Yeah, I mean we'll have to see the reports. There's so many different like people are saying so many different things that I'm getting confused. <laughs> but yeah, for that, I I mean Boudica's I feel like Boudica in the in that murder ball would just be really good, no? Just to replace your Who do you even replace your your ram maybe? Boudica already open field. Yeah, that's tough. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry man. I'm so bad with archers. I gotta ask my archer guys. I feel like investing in Boudica is good because she's like one of the newer commanders and it's kind of like forward investing. She's super flexible. She could probably pair with like the newer generations of commanders more. I feel like if you go for, for Artemisia, it might be tough to kind of like backwards invest, you know what I mean? Maybe RD first since she had defense tree and that's not way to be focused. For another march, Budka Nebu. Wow, oh, you're all inning in archers, huh? That's pretty good. I mean, the skill damage meta is, is what people love, so. <clears throat> Alright. I trust Lambo's advice. <laughs> Do Boudica YSG and keep Artie Tommy. The thing, good thing about Artemisia too, if you keep Artemisia is like... Oh no, good thing about Tommy too is that 
whenever you see a Tommy, um, that thing is gonna die instantly because one that has a debuff, but two that debuff is so like prevalent that people know that like, hey, there's a debuff on that march, let's go kill it. You know what I mean? So, like, usually you're in comms, but then if you're not in comms, you could just be like, hey, just you know, swarm down everything that has a Tamaris debuff, and then they just instantly melt. Fight on Discord, however, when people can't be on Discord, you tell them to target with a purple dot. Yeah, exactly. It's just so much easier, you know? <laughs> Get those gold heads. Yes, sir. Get that VIP. How many gold heads am I at now? S 639, so I should be able to max a new commander when she comes out for sure let's go max commander oh no yeah, unchained man i feel like my rich is never gonna die <laughs> even though it's getting low i thought it'd be dead already <laughs> You're really tired, Leon. Is, are you going into a fight? Like, are you actively about to fight in a KVK? Because if so... Then yeah, probably getting that 5551 Boudicca. That's what I'm using right now. So... And then getting the Expertise Artemisia. So what, is she, what does our SPD even do? Just extra damage dealt per second? 10% damage per second? Like, I don't I don't understand this expertise actually. <laughs> it does extra damage? Like 400 damage factor? Hoarding sculpts and a KVK three right now migrated back some time ago. Just hoarding and making some plans ahead. Oh, okay, okay. Honestly, like it's hard to plan. Um, like I had the, I always had the plan that I was going to go Leo with my Guan, and then as soon as my KVK started, they released CPO. So, um, I don't know. It's pretty tough to to plan that far ahead. But I I, I respect the grind though. I respect the the forward thought <clears throat> but yeah i would i would just yeah just hold them you know see what see what's up spin your wheels and, and stuff and then from there make a decision like i i unlocked every single commander um like when i when i first went into soc i spun all my wheels because i migrated back before my kvk3 i mean after my kvk3 ended so i didn't have a single soc wheel so I had a ton of gems saved up, and then I I just spun every wheel t to 100, but I like selectively made sure I spun every commander that I thought I'd be using to 10. And then from there, like, you know, you get to choose based on what the meta is. And it usually is the newest commanders, which is why I'm kind of really down for you to, to invest in Boudicca and not really Ar Artemisia, because she's kind of like a niche or commander like you need a specific pair for her to be very effective you know what i mean when Boudicca's like jack of all trades you could plug her with any single archer pair and you'll, you'll be good <clears throat> if you don't need to use the goldies now maybe just hold and see what commanders do they may be trash archers and maybe ch change your investment goals yeah exactly and then we just kind of keep though that's all that matters 
same thing happened to me as well. Go on Leo, but figured, but then CPU came on as a done deal. Exactly, exactly. You know what I mean? Like my whole Rise of Kingdoms career, I I watched a lot of chess goals, so obviously that's why I'm like, oh, Guan's good, right? And then after that, like, I mean, not Guan, um, CPU good. Pair with Guan, best open field march. And then <laughs> Nevsky came out, insta maxed him. And then after that, CPU came out during my KVK, so I'm like, all right, I, I don't have space for Guan anymore. Unfortunately, slash fortunately. So yeah, Meta's changed way too often, so always have to keep your mind open. I don't even know what Artemisia looks like actually, let me check. Is she actually cute? Oh, she's you're into like that type, huh Martin? I see you. We all see that Martin has a type now. <laughs> Still prefer Boudica. What does the new Boudica even look like? I use her, but like I don't know what she looks like. Her eyes take up like... I guess that's like... No, her eyes are so big. Look at the other commanders and look at hers. Look at her. She has anime eyes. What the hell? I feel like Alphaflat has the most normal looking eyes. You look at Boudica, she's like... <laughs> like, I feel like she would say like Oni, Oni chan, you know what I mean? That's definitely like Boudica's vibes. With those eyes. Um, because of the boots. Oh, you, I I just looked at the eyes, but the boots. Oh, she she she's wearing Uggs. Damn. <laughs> An anime girl wearing Uggs. She got them kawaii eyes. Yeah, exactly. You feel me? Alright, my Richard is at 233. It's dwindling slowly but surely. How are we in honor, by the way? We're 27th. We actually moved the spot, which is cool. Um... At least you can see your eyes look at Khan. I've actually never looked at Khan, like, ever in my life. 0.2% <laughs> and a fucking Unchained? Imagine. Could it be me? You still streaming? Yes, sir. Um, I'm too late to look at him. Why? Right, where? Where is? His, where are his eyes? Oh no! He's. That's not because he's. That's not racist. It's because he's just fried. You know what I mean? You got that hemp. You got that, that good shit. <laughs> I'm playing. Wait, what? Why does it keep unchaining every time? That guy actually looks like he just woke up though. <laughs> He's like that, that plump uncle that just woke up. And also, Canada showed me Pakal's earrings. I'm like, bruh. <laughs> what are those earrings? It's kind of chunky too. Yeah, he, he looks like if you slept on his stomach, it'd kind of be a comfortable comfortable night's sleep, you know? He's definitely one of those guys. That kind of sounded sus, actually, but yeah, anyways. <clears throat> Why is my last chat just emojis? <laughs> Alright, let's see what the Richard's at. Richard's at. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, yeah, just gained health. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, how do I get more? I, I could get swarmed up down here, actually. Oh, a 54 is gonna do damage. Alright, 
Next time I should do it, um, streaming until my double C dies. And then it'll be the quickest stream in Rise of Kingdoms history. <laughs> This. Oh, we gathered. Nice. I'm currently, by the way, I'm 17th in Thief Capture events. I'm not sure if I could actually get the 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 chest, but honestly, the good thing about this event is I like the ones where it's materials because you could always use them. You know what I mean? If it's a gold head ones, if you don't get top um, if you don't get top twenty for gold heads, I mean top ten for gold heads, and you just get epic sculptures, you're like fucking screwed. You know what I mean? For the, at least for the materials, like you could at least use epic materials, so it works out. One chain lol. Did it one chain? Yeah, I've, I had a little bit of unluckiness with the chains today. Maybe it's because I haven't been training in a while, so. <clears throat> also, I haven't just shared a zone with a camp in a while. It's kind of, kind of pretty interesting. And like another camp or another KD in general. Yeah, yes, yes, my Richard's dying. My dog's already sleeping. Look at him. Look at Boomer. I've been dog sitting. So what troop type is coming after archers? It's I believe it is um leadership. So it's gonna be Trajan and uh, Honda are going to be the two commanders to, to spin for that wheel for sure. Unless you want YSS in your garrison, then that's also an option. <clears throat> After that, it's cav and then infantry. So it's, yeah, it's a leadership, then cav, then infantry, then archers again, and then so on and so forth. Can, <laughs> can Richard die already? I want Plot to be done. Idea. Yeah, thanks. We'll definitely still hold them. Let's see what the new comms do. But yeah, it's just playing out my options because currently I'm bored. Yeah, honestly, that's what I did too. In KVK3, especially, like, you have nothing to do, man. <laughs> I'm sorry that you're in KVK3. I, I don't know if people actually like KVK3, but I, I just always had a negative experience with it because. I feel like you win or lose the KVK during matchmaking, so. Like you pick your allies um, or you pick your enemies and it's usually not balanced at all because, you know, it's within a certain amount of continents. It's not like, you know, matchmaked made within really broad s scale of Rise of Kingdoms. And there's always usually like one KD that's super, super strong that like might be a real Imperium in actual Rise of Kingdoms. And then all the other ones are just kind of like low A's. And then whoever has that Imperium, allies that Imperium wins, you know what I mean? So. <clears throat> I feel like it's pretty good in practice, but like in a situation where it's only like a couple continents that has the matchmaking it's pretty bad in practice <clears throat> but yeah at least you get to farm a lot get a bunch of resources 
Hey, what's up, Amish? You literally just made it to like the end of the stream. Like my Richard's dying. My Richard's dying. <laughs> Our matchmaking actually only had 100 mil diff overall. Oh wow, you actually had a balanced matchmaking. Okay, so then maybe your KVK will be fun. Has it like what part of the KVK are you in right now? No, he just got home from work. Yeah, I'm still uh, I'm still war plato right now, so. Whole region of KVK3 is pretty balanced. Okay, maybe they changed some things when I last played. Because when I played, it was literally over at matchmaking. <laughs> Somehow, um, two KDs ended up being a uh, like a B seed or whatever that were Imperium, that quote unquote Imperium, um, whatever you call it, Rising Star or whatever, and then they entered our camp. <laughs> So then we had we had three Imperiums and then we had one B seed. No one actual B seed and then we just stomped them. <clears throat> Can you explain how Circus Wonder works? I'm on day three and I DK if I got anything. Um so you should have gotten something in the mail if you got anything. Um for example, like I got this. I didn't make it past act one. So when you press Circ of, Circus of Wonders, um, if you say it can, you cannot take part in prize givings, um, wait, it, actually I don't know how to do it anymore, but practically if you got a mail saying that you got something, then that means that you didn't make it to the next stage, but if you didn't get a mail, and then I think you're still, you're still in it to win it or whatever, so. And then I think at the end, after stage four, everyone has a one percent chance. Like everyone in Rise of Kingdoms, only one percent of them gets into the the main sweepstakes of the 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 dagger or whatever. So like, right now we're in Act Three. And then if you made it here, then you can, if you made it here, um, you might get one of these awards, but then you might move on as well. And then I think everyone has a chance to get up here, but only a 1% chance at the end, so... It's literally like the lottery. <laughs> I don't know why they made an event like this, but... But yeah. Don't die, Richard. Yo, what's up, Kyle? Thanks for coming through. Yeah, the Richard... The Richard is getting low. <laughs> Richard is getting low. <clears throat> I'll try to chain properly now, but it's probably going to die no matter what. Hmm. If I get that KVK2, I'll rock. Through. Only got the Sif change in Act 2, sadly. I mean, Sif change is pretty good, but yeah. I wish I could get materials for sure. They made such an event cash grab. It's super cheap, though. It actually is just a lottery ticket. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's kind of weird. I don't know why they would make an event like that, but... I guess it'll feel good for the three people in the game that get a that get a dagger, I guess. Because only three people get a dagger in, in the whole game Rise of Kingdoms, so. Imagine that'd be a cool YouTube video. <laughs> but yeah, I already got my one one day of speed ups, so. Yeah, I feel like everything in this game is a cash grab, so I'm not really surprised. I'll hit you up if I win the dagger. <laughs> yeah, hit me up. <laughs> make sure to send a screenshot. I could uh, make a YouTube video about it. <laughs> Interview you. But yeah, my Richard actually could have lived longer if I just didn't get three march swarmed and just did a two by two at a time but yeah he's kind of low right now you guys think he could chain these or no honestly i just want to win in third or fifth stage just for the sake of getting those material chests yeah for sure 
Um, what do you even get on the fourth stage? Like, you get what? <clears throat> Seven days speed ups and then five commander sculpts. I mean, it's not the worst. Seven days of speed ups is, is not bad, but definitely I'd want the the mats for, for my account right now. And if you get to that legendary bauble, whatever, whatever, the fifth, you for sure get mats regardless, so it's really good. For two dollars, it's worth it. I don't even remember what else was in the what else was in the the bundle, honestly. So I probably should have saved it somewhere. It might be still here. It might still be here. Yeah. You got four. <laughs> so I got twenty eight hours of speeds plus four four hundred gems for um like two dollars seventy nine cents. I don't know if that's worth. It might be. 800 subs I just saw. Yeah, we hit it after actually um after I made that video about the desert con the desert uh, tracks events, desert tracks, and yeah, we got we got a little bit of traction from that. So <laughs> it was worth staying up until three three a.m. to edit that for sure. You're watching your chats on the side. True, true, true. Yeah, it felt nice. Um, felt like a little bit of a celebrity when Chisco liked my comment on his uh, <laughs> on his YouTube on his YouTube post. Um, if you check Chisco's, oops, there's an ad. Oh wow, wow, it actually has like, it actually has like 30, 36 likes right now. Like, just finally gets a taste of Desert KVK. I'm like, damn, I'm up there. I'm up there. <laughs> so yeah, that's fun. No, Richard, don't die. Don't worry, you can just refresh your Richard. Nah, I wanted to keep it like a little bit of a short stream anyways. There isn't really much going on. I just wanted to like say hello. I'd say I yesterday I said I streamed today. So I just want to keep that promise. I'll probably stream tomorrow too, just because we have arms training. Um, I could probably talk to my, to my guy about arms training and stuff, but... But yeah. <clears throat> Richard, you could do it. Oh shit, let me get it. make sure he doesn't AOE that. Yeah, I gotta see. Yeah, the thing is I don't have an expertise Charles and you really need Charles Charles for this event. Um you also kind of want a Trajan, I don't have a Trajan, so like you want the extra five percent defense, the five percent, five percent health, and then yeah, the extra five percent defense and health is is pretty big for it, I think. Oh shit! Oh well. Hmm. <clears throat> but yeah, this stream will instantly end when Richard dies. So You got gold keys? That's a good question. I got 24, so I don't have much. So, yeah, it's going to be a tough, tough one though, to win that event. My double sleep's coming back. Just came here. Were you chaining for two hours straight? I was chaining for two hours straight, actually. Um, And the stream ends as soon as Richard dies, so. <laughs> and... 